Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Just went into Coles to have a little look around, see what specials they had. 180 something dollars later. <laughs> I've got some good specials though, so it's all right. Don't mind my big massive spot on my face. It's so sore. Anyway, I've got to go home. I've got the dog. I've got the dogs inside with the boys and I lock the back door so they can't get out. So Lucy wants to go out. So I'm gonna do that and I'll show you what I got when I get home. Okay guys, I don't normally like doing it like this, but I'm just gonna pull out the bags because yeah, I've got to go up the shop and get my online order that I've done. I've got to go pick that up, it's ready, so I'm just gonna do it like this. Um, I've got some of these stone baked bread there just for hubby for lunches. I've got some canola that's got uh, berries in it and that. That will be for having with some yogurt. Got some soups, tomato and basil, and a homestyle chicken noodle soup. I've got a few deodorants, these were on a special, a couple of girls' ones, me and Scarlett are totally out, we've been using the boys. Deodorant, and I've got a man's one, so back to sharing a bathroom again now. So I've said to the kids, we'll just chuck a deodorant in the cupboard in there, and yeah, we can just share it, doesn't matter. And they had these Edgel Mexican bean, Mexican mix. Um, I've never actually seen them before and they were only a dollar so I grabbed four of them because I reckon chili con carne is definitely on the menu. Um, I had these braised steak and onions on sale as well. I've got two of those. I want to get a, we call it a rebel maker but um, the one that you got the sandwich press with the side bits and you can put some of this in there with cheese and it's so delicious. Sliced black olives, I thought I'd give the Coles Cheap Cheap brand a try. Woolies ones are really nice. I love those on my salads. Um, this bag here, I've got some tunas. So these were $1.15, it's the only time I buy them. And I got um, some just spring water ones as well. I think I only got two, or maybe got three flavors, I'm not sure got some peckish crackers and I got some sour cream and chive crackers some more soup so there's a tom yum with noodles beef with noodles and dutch curry these two seem to be pretty popular so I thought we would get some of them and give them a go they're only a dollar a box so that's good start stocking up for the cooler weather that's coming they had the rice on special so I got two of the chicken rice and two of the oriental fried rice they're really nice, I really like them. I actually did um, like um, fried rice. I think I'd use the oriental one though. Um, yeah, just added some meat into it and just some veggies and oh my God, it was so good. And I bought some of these. I always want to buy them and I never do. And then I think sometimes, oh, I wish I had some little rice, like just enough to serve, you know. Um, and they were half price, they're on special for like a dollar something, so I got myself two of those, so that's four serves, so that's good. And another tuna tuna, so yeah, four with a uh, corn and mayo and four spring water. And I got a treatment for my hair, it's just coconut milk, looking forward to using that. And I've just got some cross cuts for some like um, like snacks for this week. Cold things, I got some crumbed fish. This is the Iron J lemon crumb wild pork fish fillet. Well, they were half price, I can't even think how much they were. I'll say about $6. Yeah, pretty cheap meal. We've got some milk, look at that, beautiful. Beautiful normal Hilo milk, so, so good. Oh, I need another coffee saying that. Um, I've got a few lunch meats. What did I get? Um, I've got some salami. And I also got some ham. Just some river gum, yum. This Greek style light yogurt. This is one I like to have with my um, muesli over there. And they had some lamb, like meat bones. So I thought I'd grab some for the dogs. I think there's four in this pack. So they will love that. Oh, there is more tuna. I was just thinking, I normally get Scarlet and Hardo's favourite. They like the zesty vinaigrette one. So. 
and they had the parmesan cheese this was about five seven no five forty i'm gonna say it's normally six bucks for the other one i get and that was normally six dollars so it was a little bit of a saving and in this one i've got a few more packs of the crackers these are really good one row in a little ziploc bag or i've got the little containers with lids i'm still Unpacking everything. The house is absolutely trash still. We have packed away so much stuff, but there's just not enough storage in this house. So definitely in that respect, I'm going to miss the other house we were in because it is so good. So many cupboards. Um, some more soup for the pantry. So I've got some home stock chicken noodle and just two chicken with lots of noodles. I don't know what the difference is. I think one's more like a watery soup and one's more just sort of creamy. Got some garlic granules, two point, uh, 200 gram pack. And got some Quest bars, those are the cookie dough, chocolate chip cookie dough ones. And I think I've got four. I'm pretty sure I've got four. Hang on a sec. I've uh, got some ground garlic, and I also got a few of these Lean Cuisine meals. These were half price, 350, and these are like a smaller serving, so perfect for me. This one is lamb and rosemary, and this one is Thai green chicken curry with rice. And this one is beef stroganoff with pasta. So it looks so good. And there's my other quest bar. So I've got four of them, and they were $2.80. They're normally four bucks, so I grabbed four of those. Onions, they were a dollar a bag. And they're sweet potatoes. Just went to have a look at my receipt. To see how much the sweet potatoes were. I think they were two ninety a kilo, but they aren't on my receipt. I had troubles with the um, self service checkout I was in, so the boat ended up putting it onto the next till, and he scanned nearly all my groceries when he packed them. Um, yeah, and that was one of the first things he did, so that was weird. Um, what else we got in here? It was so good just to go to the shop. Okay, so this is another cold bag. I love my frozen veggies. This garden mix, as you know, is my absolute favourite one that I love. They were on special for four bucks in Coles. And I got just the Coles corn cobs. I was going to get the other brand, the better brand. They were four bucks bag. There's only two packs left. And then I saw these ones on, yeah. I'm pretty sure these are pretty good, so if not, I'll get the better ones. Some things you just got to pay a little bit more for, you know. I've got these skin of hokey fillets. This is a 700 gram bag. I thought I could do a nice fish curry with this. That would be really, really good. So, fish on the menu a few times this week. Actually, there's one thing I did miss living up in the bush too is um, we really enjoy having like crumbed fish with some pasta and veggies or you know, pasta and salad or whatever. And I just couldn't buy it up there because it just would not stay frozen, you know. Um, and I also got some Steggles chicken tenders. They were on special as well, four bucks a box. So there's 400 grams in one. So I've got three of those. Um, so I'm thinking we'll do some nice chicken and salad wraps one night. Um, yeah, so that's it for my coals bit anyway and that like I said where did I put my docket now oh god oh, I've got one more bag of veggies in there so meant to lose it uh, just a winter veggie to grow yeah, I'll just, just have it so that is weird yes girls look fun especially under the washing Alright guys, stay tuned for my Woolworths part. And I also missed these too, I'll just put them out on the table. These roasted chickpeas, like the salted, these are on special for about four bucks. There's six little individual wrap packs in there. These are really nice. I haven't had these for ages. So i am put some of those in my handbag for a little healthy treat. One of those will also go in my handbag. Just get back to basics and get my butt back on track. Okay hey guys, just got back from Woolies. I want to show you all my cold stuff so I can get it put away. It was quite hot in here. I've just cranked the aircon up so it just got cold. Um, so I got these strawberry milkshake paddle pops out on special. I've got a block of parmesan cheese and I have two. Um, I've 
we've got baby bells, they were two dollars eighty on special in Woolies. So we've got two of those. I like having those as snacks for myself. I've got some more leg ham. My son just bought me a variable power toasty, so we can do four at a time in there. It's so cool. That's my Mother's Day and my birthday present. So that was very nice of him. Um yeah, so that's why I got more ham so I can make some toasties with like ham, cheese, tomato and mm, I'm gonna make them some in a minute for lunch. And I've got a few chicken breast, 942. I only asked for two of them, that seems like they're gonna be huge. And I've got a block of cheese, some butter, two one kilo tubs of vanilla yogurt, and I've got some beef burgers as well. They actually had lots of these today. And I don't even have the buns or anything else to go with it, but I just thought it doesn't matter. I'll just pop them in the freezer and I'll be ready to go. Okay, continuing on, I just packed away all the cold things. So I got some dentist sticks for the dogs. They were 12 bucks. These are really good and the dogs absolutely love them. Lucy actually likes these better than the Smackos now. And we got some cereal, some Sultana brand and some Special K. And they were on special for $5.50 a box. And that one's $5.35 grams and that one's a $7.30. So that's not bad. I was actually thinking I didn't get cereal. So it's really quite annoying. He spent so much money and he still needs so much stuff. It's like, ugh. Um, I've got some dog food. I just bought some of these big cans. Just cheapies. I've got dog biscuits and stuff. And you get three other things. So I've got eight of those. I've got some mint sauce. And I've got some more spray. I have gone through about three bottles of this so far and I haven't even started really cleaning this house yet. Um, well, I have, but I haven't even done like 10% of it. It's just, oh my God. But that's a whole, yeah, another story. Um, I've got some of the snacks. These were also unspecial. They were only 2 35 each, which is really cheap for six snacks. And I've got nacho cheese flavor. Never tried that before, so it'd be interesting to see if they like it. We've got tasty cheese and cheddar as well. And I saw a clearance box in Smoke Mart, so I popped in there and had a quick look, and they've got these cups. So there's no drama llama. And they were 10 bucks down to $2, so I picked it up for Scarlet, and I'm going to take it out the box, and I want to buy an Easter egg that will fit in, top of, in the top of it. And I might wrap it up in some clear cellophane or something. That'd be cool for Easter for her. Uh, I got some dead oil. That was half price as well. I think it was seven bucks, normally 14. Um, yeah, it was good to have have on standby in your house. Um, this stuff in here is from Big W. I picked up just a couple of pairs of leggings for myself, black pair that are shorter and just a grey longer pair. And I've got these popping candy things just for kiddos for Easter as well. Um, cappuccinos, I got some speckled eggs and some hunting Easter eggs for Easter. There's uh, another deodorant, <laughs> fresh produce. I got some onions, so yeah, I've got two of them. I normally buy three, so it's gonna take a little bit to get in the swing of shopping down here again and not going to the shop every five minutes. Um, but yeah, oh, I don't even know how much they were actually. They were $1.20 a kilo, so, and I got them, that was in my pickup order. I don't mind them picking my onions, but that's about all, I'll let them pick. And they had these Pink Lady Apples, and like, this looked like a pretty good bag. The other ones looked pretty crappy. Um, but I was thinking like, you could just peel that. They're not too bad. They were seven ninety for two kilos, so, and loose by themselves. They're 7 a kilo at the moment, so it's just ridiculous. But I'm just getting back into enjoying my Pink Lady apple with almond butter. So I really want apples in the house. Asparagus. I was looking ahead in the catalogue and I waited for today to buy this. $1.80 a bunch, so I got myself three of those. I've actually got the asparagus growing in the garden back here in this house. So picked a couple the other day, so that's grown pretty good, so that's cool. Zucchinis, they were two for two bucks. I've got some red capsicums. I've got a big tub of hummus I need to get through. So that's gonna help me. And three avocados. These are the shepherd ones. I'm not really overly fussed on these. I really 
they've got the house on thinner. But, um, yeah, 220 each, that was okay, because Coles had two for five bucks, so, yeah, a little bit cheaper. Got some Nanas. Hubby will be happy with those bananas from Woolies, because every time we buy them from Aldi, they're Woolies all the time. It's stupid. And we got some baked beans. We love baked beans, and now that we've got the toasty machine, I'm gonna make some baked bean and cheese brevels. Oh my god, so good. Um, I've got some seeds. I've got four packs included for my what I spent. And I also, in my pickup order, had some paper towel. And um, what did I spend? Okay, so my online was $60.55. And when I went in to Woolies to get a few other things, I had on my list, I spent $145.80. So between Coles, Woolies, and Woolies, <laughs> I spent a total of, okay, so my total was 391.34. Blocks are dry. I still haven't got bread. I've got to go get bread and I've only bought three liters of Hilo milk and two liters of skim, so that's definitely not enough either. Just waiting in the car, just ran and dry down to Aldi. get some white bread. I cannot make him brevels on wholemeal bread. It's so gross. No, I thought it was white, but it's like a big loaf of pink bread. I don't even know where I got it from actually. I did not buy that. But I didn't even have any of mine in the freezer either, so. But yeah, you definitely need white bread. And we come back to the Audi that we live near. And one of the blokes that used to work here is so nice, he's not here anymore. And the creepy security guard's back. Which is weird because um, someone else complained about him. So, and then he's back here again. 